welcome back to my vehicle. This is Sess. Welcome back to part two of Campus Life. And today we are discussing career, dress code, and culture show. So guys, stay tuned. Oh my goodness. Yes, stay tuned. <laughs> <laughs> guys uh let's talk about culture shock in campus there are those things we used to be told we used to hear about campus life and then when you reach there you are like whoa this is not in campus or you find something different so what's that one particular thing that you got surprised when you reached campus or when you started your campus life let's start with maria mm, i would say the culture shock that i encountered was dressing like the way people are dressing, especially in our school, because there is no limitation to what you can wear. Like some people can wear clothes that are, I don't know what word to use, but it's not respectful. And sometimes even the lecture on Akutani Zazimze. So I think that was one of the culture shock that I encountered when the university. How about you, Dina? <laughs> Oh, I think my, my experience is somewhat similar to Maria's. Mm -hmm. When I went to the U, we are not from a very, I'm not from a very urban area. Many people used to come in and start in university. You know the stories of, oh, in university you can go with whatever dress you want. Yeah. Eh. But when you get there, <laughs> well, I, mean, I saw girls in Kenya that actually shocked me. You see that kind of shock that makes you stop by the road, umanga. Yes, to do. Hadi Aisha, and then you're like, wow, she's walking dressed like that. Mm -hmm. Like, at a mini skirt, at a mini dress, it's just great. Mm -hmm. Where? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And did it ever affect you? At first, I used to think how, sorry to say, immoral they were. Mm -hmm. And then, <laughs> like but she, later, you joined, <laughs> you joined, you joined the club. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I did not join the club. Uh -huh. But, okay, I don't have, uh, what can I say? I don't have enough confidence to dress mm -hmm. like that. So later, I started looking at it from a different perspective. If anyone can dress like that and walk on that road with that much confidence, they believe me what I'm Like, mm -hmm. they have. They are so comfortable in their skin, in their body, in everything that they are, that they don't even care whether you look at them or they don't. Actually, yes, in Africa, you know. actually you should say, if you're comfortable, mm, that, that's yeah, it. That's, yeah, that's how it changes your mentality. I said, if always I see a girl who's dressed in a certain way, not very exposed, but you know, that kind of thing you would not wear. I'd say, mm, she's very brave. Me, me, actually, is and if you're so exposed with your legs, with your Boobies, I don't care. As long as you are comfortable, yeah, those people are strong. Yeah. yeah. So, how about you, Martin? Uh, for me, the experience that I encountered was from high school. Mm -hmm. I came from a private school, so you know that to me. So, going to a campus, you find a lot of people. There's no like a head, uh, how's it called? It's on duty to guide you from where to move. Uh, so, that's the kind of culture shock that you encounter. Wow. Yeah, I think mine is similar to Martin's. So in campus, there's a lot of freedom. Like there's no one telling you do this, do that. There's no like your parent is not there. There's no teacher. Even the lecturers don't care. Of course, at the end they'll care when you want to do exams. But during classes, they won't care if you not come to class, if not, or if you not done any cards. So that's the, the, the freedom that. I had in campus so that was one of my main culture shock mm -hmm. and then also I was like campus is just a place for like going out with friends going to parties not attending classes and stuff and stuff but when I reached there as I said in my previous episode I went to study with uh, much older people so that's not what I got I got something very different. The people I studied with were very structured, very orderly, and me I was, you know, I was expecting hype, like hype, just going out with your boyfriends and stuff and stuff. It was so different. So wow, it hit me like, yeah, okay, yeah. So guys, that's our experiences when it comes to culture shock. Yeah, 
I know everyone has experienced that culture shock in their campus, during their campus life. Comment down below and let us read your culture shock experience.